Hello, peoples, peopleettes. Welcome back to the Walking Dead. Today we'll be sucking some Walker pe. Never mind. You know, speaking of, do you think like people actually try having sex with walkers? <laughs> be funny. It's a funny joke, right? Like, what happens to like your dick when you turn into a zombie? I wonder. To get all green and like fucked up. Ugh. No, thank you. It's a nice image for you to have in your head. So, it is late, but I wanted to get another episode done because, yeah, I was feeling it. Maybe two. Maybe three. We'll see how I'm feeling. But, uh, yeah. Okay, I'm back. Let us continue on our game. Starved for hope. Whew, I'm excited. God, I love this game. Previously. I know who you are. Oh, I got another good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, my God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. This game series adapts to the choices you make, the stories are tailored by how you play. they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Martha. I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. 
We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Larry's just... looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <sighs> Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. Yeah, I know. I'm just really frickin' hungry. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Can't chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Was he bitten? Bitten? No, I swear. Hurry, please, hurry! Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. No. Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee! Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! Please hurry! No, no, no! Stop! Lee, do something! Please! Get me out of this! Oh god, oh god, oh god! Stop! 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 Oh god! Please save him! Hurry! He's lost so much blood already! Please hurry up! Let's go! Let's go! That's through nothing. Do you think you can get it open? Come on! Lee, it has to be now! No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! Damn it, Lee, just cut off his fucking leg! Ah. I'm sorry, but we have to go! Now! Did you at least put a tourniquet on? Ah. Can't keep him back forever! Oh, God. Fuck, I'm just wasting ammo now! We gotta go! Oh, God, there's so... Ah! Oh, God. Shit. 
is he? He passed out. How am I even supposed to do anything about him? If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! My dad was special forces, I know what I'm doing. Ben, you don't want a friend like that. He seems like a special character. <laughs> No hammers. The gate's open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! God. What happened? What the hell are What's going on? I don't have time to explain. Me, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What? No, Come on. I don't! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We left the other one behind. Other one? Jesus, Lee. What if there are more of them? What if they followed you here? There wasn't anybody else. Just us. How do you know he's not lying? Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <laughs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. He makes all the choices for everybody. Once Katcha patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. Okay. 
That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Four items of food for ten huh? God. That's fucked. That is so fucked. We cannot provide. Uh, so... Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this. Sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Whole ass link to get to the stream. <laughs> you typed the whole ass link. No. <laughs> oh god, what do we do? So great. You Will both you are hold so the amazing. Damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Larry, you crazy cuck. Oops, oops, no, no monkey for you. God, leave my stream alone. This is a wholesome Walking Dead stream. We all have fun here. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Claire. I've got to take care of some things. You are not funny at all. You're playing with Duck for a while. Okay. Hey, Duck. How about a little food? What do I give him? What do I give the duck? Huh? Tell me what I give the kid. Kill it. No, I will not. I will, I'm giving the child food. Decide what I give him. Pick. Look at him. Look at how happy he is. He gets to eat. No way. What kind of food is he going to get? Look at him. Look at him celebrating. Look at. Look. Oh, wow. Woo. Woo. Yay. Food. Ah, uh, so delicious. Dust. He does not get dust. Half apple. Okay, well, Dom is a fucking Nazi, so. Oh, heck yes! Is there peanut butter? We do not have peanut butter, you fat what fuck! You think, duck? No. Probably I wanna not. abuse you, dude. I wanna abuse you. I've eaten five years ago. There are three food pieces left. We must provide Carly Want something to eat. Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. Thank I know you. I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but You don't owe me anything, Carly. Keep them both. <laughs> yeah, I'll keep all the food for myself. Wonder if I can do that. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. What do I give Clem? Do not say dust. Do not feed. What do I give? Decide now. 
with speed. Not picking exit, not picking dust. We don't feed child children. No, we do, we do. What do we feed? What do we give? What do we offer? Perhaps. What kind of food? Or rat jerky. Dog? Okay, jerky. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. Well, you don't <laughs> get a Sunday, you bitch! <laughs> Expecting handouts. You think you are. Who do you think you are? Larry, your daughter's a piece of shit. I'm not feeding you. <laughs> Who do I feed next? Myself? No. I'll feed a fucking cow. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Kill him if he leaves. <laughs> you can. Want something to eat? Crackers Here, for you. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. What I've left. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Now, who's gone longer though? I don't know. I don't know. I do not know. Please, someone tell me. Please, someone How's tell going, me. Lee? From up here, it looks like you're playing favorites. You want food? Hmm? Hmm? Yeah? I'm playing favorites? Is this playing favorites? Hmm? Is this playing favorites? Tell me. Tell me, is this playing favorites? Here, Larry. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Tough choice. Ah, oh, man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. But I love my axe. Here, this should help. Try not to make too much noise. Yeah, yeah, we're not stupid. God, calm Come down, on. Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal... I just make gave you some crack. crackers, you ungrateful old bitch. Kill him with the axe. God, you are savage. Savage evil men and women. Then eat him? Why feed him? He gonna leave. No mercy. God. Not such an easy job, is it? Don't look at me like that. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Well, no shit. Don't, don't shake your head at me like that. Ken, uh, Lee, come here, please. I should have fed he Katja. Make it, did he? he lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Jesus. Ken, come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Ugh. I don't know, maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried. 
But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Kill him. Oh shit, what the fuck? Jesus Christ! God! God, fuck! Got it! Oh, what the fuck is happening? What is this glitchy bullshit? What the? I can't. You missed! You missed! You missed! You missed! You missed! Holy shit! Pull the axe out of your fucking. Pull it! Jesus Christ! What the fuck? You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Suck my Hold dick, down. Larry. Suck him. my Kill fat him. dick. You missed him. He was sitting right there. Oh God. You said he wasn't bitten. What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no. Oh, they don't know he yet. Wasn't. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. You're lying. It's true. I swear it. Maybe he's right. I didn't see any bites. It would explain why there's so many of them. Jesus Christ. If you just die, and that's all... <sighs> McCheese out of it, Blabow. Why is everyone incompetent? Should've gave Mark the axe. Yeah, I should've. I should've. Very intelligent to be done. Shit. One fatal car wreck in a family of five turns into a family of walkers. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Ooh. Whoa, lady, relax. Me shoot, and my brother, we, shoot, we shoot, just want to know shoot, if y'all can help us shoot, out. I said back shoot, off. Shoot, 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 shoot. You're outnumbered here. Kill them. Turn around and go Kill back. Kill them all. Kill okay, them both. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if, if you could part with shoot. some extra gas before we leave. Shoot. Why do you need gas? Shoot. Our place is protected by an shoot. electric fence. Shoot. Generators shoot. provide. So you don't become Markiplier. Yes. Blood. Generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles away. Yeah, we own a dairy farm a few miles away. We are loyal, loyal guns. guns. We can talk, talk about some, some kind of trade. deal. Some How party, you, you know? Food? How you doing on food? We, we got, got plenty of it at the dairy. I want to kill him. Shoot. Shoot, Please, shoot, why don't you shoot, 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 we need to think like a group, Lee. This affects everyone. Then we vote. If everyone agrees, then we'll send you guys with some gas to check the place out. And if we don't? Then we'll stay in this wretched roach motel with your recreational paperweight over there. Plus, we stay close to Macon where we have access to the pharmacy. For Dad. Penny? Katja? We go. Dad? You bet you, pumpkin. Harley? I said we go. I'm in. If they're offering literally the only guy. Cool. 
Clementine. What do you think? We're just gonna say stay. Very hungry. Let's just let's just go. Like let's just go. Let's just let's just go to let's go to the dairy. Let's go to the dairy. Blood for the blood god. Classic door to door scammers. I agree. <laughs> yeah, I mean just classic. It's like we live in a patriarchal society. So fucking liberals. You guys really have Dirty liberals, sure man. We lost most of the cattle, but we still liberals have made of the milk, zombies. And, cheese up. and with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. With the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. <gasps> Excellent idea. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. <clears throat> Not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. He was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. We <laughs> steal a gun. We live in a society. Do you not believe them? They spread lies. Right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Motor ends my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? You can say that again. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, <clears throat> who's running things over there? I am. I am. You guys have any questions? Come to me. <laughs> this is a dictatorship. <laughs> How many people you got over there? Yeah, sir. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love. He, he. You know, I'm sick and tired of this fucking. This bullshit you're pulling. This bullshit. This pure, pure bullshit. Maybe you two. Maybe you are spies for the patriarchal government, the society. He, we live in a society. Like I said, we got plenty of food and quite I'm sick and tired of this. Sick and tired of it. And I don't want to deal with it anymore. You both are just like freaking members of society and it just pisses me off. Just rubs me the wrong way. Use an extra helping hand. Frankly, we can always use it. I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. You know, nobody Everything asked Ben. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember. I want to punch them. Now, it's really, really hard. You're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always oh, pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who are they? Fuck you! Fuck you knew ass. we were hungry, <coughs> and you guys will keep it all to yourself. Oh well, no, there's Yeah, and you know what? More. We ate it all. What are you gonna? That. You know what? You're right. I'm getting look in front of the chat. No one, Danny and I got you covered or something happens, but let's just wait this out. Look, these guys are members of society. See how Fuck people you. of society decide. Members of society decide things, guys. Come on, let's get to the dairy for a sake. No. Fuck you. Fuck you, asshole. You know what? Maybe we did eat it all. We ate all of it. 
Raw footage of sheep of society. <laughs> fuck you, <laughs> fuck you. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Ever have any accidents? Ah, it's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with Coco coming down the drive. Yeah, she pissed me off. Their whole Humble family pissed Saint me John, off. And welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's been living down at the old motel. They're all away. fat. All really fat. Staying at the old motel. Like, they must eat a lot. My goodness, Quite that a place bit. is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. <clears throat> that motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh, yeah, uh, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make well, sure you safe. Well, it don't matter. Here now, let me... Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Green. Can't get stuff it's like green. that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That shit's green. That's right. I'm not eating Adele great. Will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help oh, you folks Jesus, out. Jesus, Mark. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Oh my Jesus Christ, Mark! Check this court. I'll check society. I'll check the sheep. Get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up the Danny's got like over here. some bad I'd posture. I'd want to take someone with you. Remember, <clears throat> those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Please don't leave me. I don't want to stay here. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Mark, take a look, look around. Why don't you get settled down? Like I can do some answer you and me. Sometimes <clears throat> they did get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generator. I wanna stab him. Run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place. Is this man incredible. Minnesotan? It's got pause. Pause a minute. This man. This man. He just you betcha, Mr. Saint John. <laughs> He must be in the northern states. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh yeah, I'm a Minnesotan. Hey, you come out here in the south. Fence? Oh yeah, it's got a lot of food. It's got that fence, yes. This might turn out to oh, be I tell ya. Oh, I tell ya. Listen, I play this stay. Hmm. We, I think that we should be real helpful and I'd be in that helpful mood there, but I think we should be out there helping out as much as we can. We should do whatever we can to make these people. Yeah, we should make them like us, you know, we're likeable people us Minnesotans, you know. You know, you know, I mean, um, I'll be out there, uh, someone asked me for some help, and I say, uh, oh, you betcha, you betcha I'll help you out right away, you know. Hey, affiliating with them and shit, you know, hey. Seems the societal members have left. Did they bake fucking shoes? <laughs> it looks like that. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Getting the perimeter secured is gonna help us a lot. 
We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm gonna get back to it. Dude, what is that in the background? A swing. Perhaps a swan. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. <laughs> Why, <I> fix it? <coughs> sure. That'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Dude, I want to shoot like him. Just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Pull your weight by fixing a swing. You're such an excellent man. You must also be of the Minnesotan descent. <laughs> noose! God, Logan, please! Please! A noose for the kids? Question mark. Be so excellent and cool. Man, this fence is fantastic. We'll do whatever you want to help keep it running. Well, clearing that perimeter is going to be a big help. Just let me oh, know when you're ready. You. In the mouth. In the fish. Logan, you just need to stop for a moment. Dom, can you please um put him in timeout? He's um he's bringing bad vibes to this. Make <laughs> he's bringing bad vibes to this chat. I do not appreciate it. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah. If anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Well, protecting your people is important, but in my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn on... Well, that'll be great. <laughs> Section, and, uh, you guys could strip them all Silence this fucking point. heretic. Well, Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. I want to smack him. Like the, these guys piss me off. How like two-faced they seem. They seem way too nice. Like there's nobody that nice. I'm just saying. It's like that voice you use when you meet like strangers in public. It's like, hi, yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. Johns to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is gonna go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I... I'm, I'm sorry, alright? He spits out a lot. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to know that. Give a wrench. I can't seem to give a wrench at the moment. There's one. Let me guess, it's still alive? Ugh. Lee, it's dead. It's dead. Come on, let's push it off. You sure? Disgusting. Uh. Come on, I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, <clears throat> this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Uh, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. You could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this... Hey, you should have cheese with ketchup, you fucking devil. 
What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. <clears throat> I see it. There's a bend in this one. Not good. He's still alive, I'm guessing? No. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Maybe we should take the hands off? Christ. I'm just gonna leave this on. Can't stop thinking about dinner. No, disgusting. Do not eat cheese with ketchup. Nice I was joking. I get hungry Ugh. too. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on, Ooh, I think rough. I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> <clears throat> He's listening to the poll. Look at all these, like. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh, oh fuck! What the? Heck? Get to the gate. Get down, you asshole! Jesus. One in your back. Now you're Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. You think I can't see ya? Get out of the open. Did you really think you fucking that shit? Christ of mercy. I have an idea. You got lucky that time. Give us the food! Get closer! I can do this all day! Come on, if we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house! Ah! They're all oh, shit, that hurts! You fuck! Try to lure me to the out there, we'll take what we want! What about our arrangements? What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move. I already got one of you. Where's our food, you asshole? I forgot where you think you're going. <laughs> Try to lure me to the open. Uh, another one? How many of those things did Man, we push down? Up. I don't even remember pushing this one down. Because we didn't. Because he's still alive. Left not in the. Ugh. Tom. Leave. No, I'm taking away your mod when I have the chance. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. Bald zombie lol. <laughs> What's wrong? Uh, 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 that was a 
goddamn ambush out there! Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark! Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, <coughs> I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. And our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. Room temperature. We need a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place oh, over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Spoiler alert. That is a lie. <laughs> what to do? Oh god, it's 124. Fuck. If I had any sense, I would get off now, but... I sadly am not known for that. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. If there's not enough room, in I, the I, house I get for it. All I get us, it. I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Good lord. That it? That all? Okay. You waste my time. <laughs> I'm done here. I don't need to talk to people. It's overrated. Okay, bye. See ya. Probably gonna nod off. Don't say nod off. You sound so stupid. Fellas, how you feeling, Lee? Look. I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. <clears throat> Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed.
pissed at me because I didn't check in with everyone, right? Okay, rude lamo. You said not off. That kind of just makes me mad. <laughs> See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Here. Oh shit, you found it? <clears throat> Literally camping. <laughs> Sneak up to the camp. Well, the only way is forward, so. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. small it can't be their main base that's what I was thinking take a look around anyway there's probably some shit around here they stole from us it looks pretty new anybody inside two sleeping bags one of them's kid sized What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Well, so, so should we grab the food back? I mean, like, yeah, we'll just leave it here. It's fucking cool. Okay. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Hey, I'll smell fumes. I need to. <laughs> just kidding. Silly Sue's. Nothing. Empty. <clears throat> what do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily? I thought you were running things back there. Yeah, but uh, uh she's got the combat training. Again. Or not. Is that the hat? Shit. The hell? Don't fucking move. Shit! 
Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? A little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Enough. Y'all wave them guns like you're looking to die. Oh, her head is gone. Shit! What the hell'd you do that for? We had a deal with them. Justice. They've killed too many people. Whatever, Tex. God. I mean, I know she was crazy, but damn. Her head is gone. Oh, oh. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. She ain't one of them, though. So, I don't know why... Losing our minds over it. Come on. You know, I'm thinking maybe we shouldn't have shot her. Just kidding. Should have died anyway. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Unless she wouldn't have. Unless I'm thinking wrong. I don't know. Whatever. Doesn't matter now. She sells Cumber Tide's hat. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. You're back. What happened? Lee took care of it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. And screwed up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Don't mind them, it's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all did a little testing. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Mark? What about Mark? My boy Mark. My boy Marquise Brownlee. 
My eye hurts. Oh my god. I still have to do shit before I go to bed. Oh. Uh, I don't want to stop. But I might. Uh, I think it would be best if I stopped. Well, um, I'm gonna stop then. It was good. It was fun for the whole family. But now, I just need to go to bed. School and my grades happen to be a priority that I hope to keep instead of going 10 assignments behind in the first week. Uh, do shit. Uh, so, oh, uh, yeah, I will finish this up tomorrow. If you want some entertaining stuff, go look at the um, comments. Fucking. Dom and Logan really blasted that shit up. Anyway, I will, um, I'll see you all tomorrow, probably. You all won people. Anyway, uh, yeah, so, appreciate you watching, anyone watching. So, yeah, have a good night.